our power, a lot of times people don't believe uh, unless they're the mayor, unless they're uh, a television star or an actor or an actress. They don't believe that they have power. Uh, I think each of us have come from experiences where we started where we were, yes. did all we could, uh, and trusted God to help us with that. Absolutely. How do we do that? How do you tell people who watch you, uh, you know, Brandon's wife, Dixie, who watches you? Yes. You know, you just encouraged her. Yeah. Uh, how does Dixie and others, like all of us in this room, take our experiences and our platform and begin to, you know, help somebody else? Well, the thing is, is it's, it's one person at a time. So I use my platform and, you know, I've grown my social media and all that. But when I started in this business, there was no social media. I was just a girl with a reality. And my reality resonated with other girls because our instances and our experiences were the same. I grew up in South Central Los Angeles where I, you know, could have went one of two ways. And the expectation was for me to go not the right way and I was determined and I knew that I wanted to be somebody and I knew that you know the world was mine for the taking and I always felt like that I was never the girl in my shout out to my parents Michelle and Evan Pickford who raised us the way we they did and my three brothers but they instilled a sense of you can do and be whatever you want to be and I believe that since I was a little girl so I charge myself with the ability and the notion to actually go out there and do it. Absolutely. And I went to college and I set goals and I decided, you know, even when it wasn't easy, I'm not saying that it's going to be easy. It actually is more frightening than it ever is easy, you know, Mr. Mayor. But it's the courage to walk in that fear. It's the courage to keep moving even when your lip are quivering and your yeah. knees are kind of shaking. It's because once you keep moving, you find a second wind. That's right. And it's that passion that's going to propel you and you'll realize that you, like everyone else that you admire, the stars, the constellation in the sky, you are meant for your light. Use your light, whatever that is. Your light is one thing, my light is another, but you look up at the stars and us all together, we literally illuminate the earth.